Hey, everybody. Welcome back to See Dad's React. <laughs> My name's Clay. That's Corey. Uh, we are checking out Loki, episode three, <laughs> season two, episode three right now. Um, we just got done watching Gen V. Uh, so, hey, if you're into that show as well, make sure you check out that part of our content. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe. If you're not new here, thanks for coming back. We love you guys. Um, Loki, we were just saying a second ago, I feel like we've watched so much Loki and we're literally only on the third episode. Like, I feel like we've watched so much. And I don't know why that is. I mean, you said they were long, but man, they are. I think this the is... first two episodes have just been really engaging. Like, they've been fun and creative and gave you some parts of the story and got a little tension in there as well. And we're kind of knowing for you, for your sake, like, what's kind of the problem and we're going to solve it and everything. And it's all I get ask. To jump. Now, and now we know we're kind of lost in time a little bit. So we're going to we're going to jump around and figure out some shit. And a whole bunch of pruning happened, so we have a lot less to track right now. A whole bunch yeah. of pruning just happened. Um, Sylvie's cool. She went back to her McDonald's. Um, yeah, so there's some interesting stuff going on. And she had whatever that was she was holding at the very end that we both didn't really know. I think it may have been a, one of the pads, but maybe not. I don't know. They're going to tell us here uh, hopefully very soon. But, um, yeah, I'm interested to see what she's going to do with whatever she took from the TVA when she went back to her uh, McDonald's. So without further ado, let's do episode three, all right? Yep, let's do it. <laughs> what a fun little sure way to just... open that. Look at who put some flourish on the end of that little arrangement. <laughs> Holy shit, man. Look at the sets they had to build for this. This is a, this is awesome. So notice, by the way, sacred timeline. They tell you which timeline you're on in case you're not on the sacred timeline. They don't exactly blend in. Okay. Better. <laughs> <laughs> but no, not really. Still probably like 50 years off, just letting you know. <laughs> well, that shit's real important this season, isn't it? It's how it all works! <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you're looking for, man, there's always a book. Otherwise, it will fail. And the TV will be destroyed. And we're all gonna die. <laughs> okay, we gotta hit on the temp pad going for looking dapper, boys. The World's Fair, 1893. The White City, Edison. Branch timeline. There she is. <laughs> there she is. Because I see everything. I notice everything. Well, you you got some crackers up on that tent. How about that? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Pause that that tall. <laughs> you think human food really tastes like ash to him because he's tasted the nectar of the gods? I feel all of the food that he's probably had in his life that like kettle corn or whatever they're eating is nothing that is he's ever going to be like, that's delicious. <laughs> right. And it's Loki. So describing it as Ash is just. Perfect. Well. Is that the balloon? It sure is. Sound like this terrifying figure. Don't be shocked. Yes. When I tell you that time. Yeah. Let's not. Let's not look past the f the fact that a god is fucking scared of someone. Whoa! 
Welcome to the future, my friend. I think you're saying it a bit close there, bud. Step aside, Hornswoggler. I was <laughs> here first. <laughs> One thousand dollars. What that translates to now, money? Hey, clown! You stepped on my foot. I do. God damn! Where the fuck did you come from, you big bastard? Nice. <laughs> Excellent suggestion. I agree. Oh, come on. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's fucking great. Timely. Excuse me. I wipe that spider. He's such a great actor. <laughs> Look, that you're really good at getting away. We have that in court. Oh. Sylvie! There she is. Time to go to work. Don't play the teamwork card on me now. Oh, can I play the you tried to kill me card? Does that get me anywhere? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't give him this book. I never heard the name Victor Timely until today. I was shocked when I... I like how he chucked the book just like uh, Ouroboros chucked it to him. Oh. Ooh. Damn. Shit. Miss Minutes? Yeah. This is your moment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, boo. <laughs> okay. Come on. No way, dude. Absolutely not. <laughs> Please chase him on a bicycle built for two. <laughs> I need that image in my life. Excusez-moi, mademoiselle. Minutes. <laughs> you are... Uh, I can watch this dude try on shoes and talk. Right. Work for the TVA. Well... Even before the TVA, or her, you <laughs> created me. <laughs> like, pushed her out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. But he was protecting me. Mm, he switches sides. It's a well-documented. <laughs> yep, that is true. Outside! That guy's gonna have a heart attack. Looking for him. <laughs> I got him rolling in at least. Ah, uh, I wanted more of that. Go ahead. I beg your pardon. Take him to New York. <laughs> I love the music. That's the best. This fucking guy, with all of his hidey holes. Yes. I brought it to you. You brought it to him the way the postman brought <laughs> the post. <laughs> she just can't let her have it, huh? Nope, it's so great. Damn, did that shit clear? I'm about to say, bro, how long you been folding that shit? I'm starting to see the man you'll become. Appreciate that. Move on now. <laughs> Miss Minutes is not doing well back there in the background. <laughs> no. God, her face is fucking priceless. Well, maybe not. A little smirk there, a little smile there. Maybe she's not. Yep, yeah, there it is. Oh, shit, never mind. You got got. You heard her, Victor. Partnership. You had to do it. <laughs> Bye. Damn. <laughs> that clock is cold. Oh, that's fantastic. Ah, it's cold. This is it. The culmination 
of my life. Do we recognize that? I don't recognize anything, man. I was, I was hoping. <laughs> I appreciate the constant belief. I, you know, <laughs> you know, I try. I was allowed to have wants and follow whims and become who I am. <laughs> Way to keep proving that you can't trust AI. I could have been your girl. Ooh, that's not creepy. Put that down. Don't do this for a change. You need me. I love you. <laughs> Don't call her back up. Holy oh, shit. Oh, boy. <laughs> Lover's tip. Yeah, <laughs> she got to you. That's, that's very uh, dangerous. Is that a fucking pruner? Is that like a, an old school pruner? Yes to keep track of the big picture here. <laughs> <laughs> to act. To keep order. Did you happen to notice? I like how Loki's got his hands all charged up. I'm order. No. Oh, shit. That wasn't Loki, though. Yep. Can I, I can't keep bringing this up, but you have to use his temporal aura. Someone just tell her the plan. Walk through. He's like, at this point, gladly. Yeah, he's like, I gotta get the fuck out of here. I suppose I've been a box you've been wanting to tick for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Pow! Be careful what you wish for. Ooh, where'd you go? To the end of time, baby. Nice. Big cord. Ew. Love you. <laughs> Whoops. Someone who knows all his secrets. I know a really big one about you. And credits. What's Renslayer's secret? I know, man. Like one of these days, like TV will be kind and they'll go, hey, guys, we know you want us just to finish out this last little part and it'll put it in there for us. Not anytime soon. No, no, no. Long after I'm dead. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, this show is just... How are they packing so much into... Like, I, and, I, and it's it's only 50 minutes long. I mean, we're at credits at the 49-minute mark. So it's 50-minute episodes, man. And it just feels like there is so much content and so much story. They're doing a good job. That's all I can say. They're doing a really, a really yeah, good job. Yeah, it's fantastic. It's fun. I can't, I can't fault it at all. It's in, it's engaging. It's hilarious. The action's fantastic, and the story is just it's intriguing. And I and I mean, other than fixing the timeline and making sure everything's back to okay, I don't know if there's anything past that. But for this show, I'm okay with that. Because there's enough to tell me, there's enough to do to get that timeline. Because it's a big enough issue, a big enough problem that I'm not distracted. Um, I know I mentioned it before, but with Ahsoka, it was like, let's get Ezra home. Okay, big deal. Like, okay, cool. So we, so, <laughs> okay, this one's a lot bigger. It's like, make sure the whole fucking reality of time doesn't unravel. That's a good enough. That's a good enough plot for a season for me to fix. Like, okay, we're cool. <laughs> let's let's go with that and let's see how we get there. So I, I'm okay with a grandiose um, plan for the season. So I don't know. It's yeah. still a great show. 
Yeah, it's fantastic, and I think they got 50 minutes, and I think they're using all 50 of it, like, fantastic, right? Like, <laughs> Every you're second. getting action, you're getting, like, plot lines that you go, ooh, I want more of that, and you're still got our big problem. Like, I'm, yeah, dude, this show's fucking top-notch. It's so good, it's so good. All right, well, everybody who stayed to the end, thank you. Um, let us know in the comments below what your favorite part about these three episodes have been so far. And does <laughs> it feel as long and as much content as it does to us watching just these three episodes. Uh, let us know in the comments below. And until next time, we'll see you guys then. See you guys.